All right, here we are guys. I gotta describe what's going on in a minute. All righty guys, I'm sorry for the wind. So, so sorry, it's the afternoon. This morning was horrible. The, the, the birds were going somewhere else this morning, not this field. It turns out they got one feed in the morning and a different one in the afternoon. The boys aren't with me. This is just a solo hunt. What it's turned into, me and Fred. Again, I'm sorry for the wind. I have a wind muff on this camera. I hope it's working. I'm sure you guys are getting blown out a little bit, but I got a really small spread in front of me, real tight. You're lucky. Real tight, just one bag of decoys, about two to three dozen is all. All full bodies, no motion in it. When I was parking the truck, oh, okay, I gotta shut up and shoot. When I was parking the truck, I had 10 land. They love it already, so here we go. Oh, they're hard to hit in the wind, Fred. Here, heel. They're really hard to hit in the wind. Oh boy. Got one down. There's another. Fred. Good dog. Good dog. <laughs> Two birds down. Good here. Good here. Here. Good. Good here. Fred. Good dog. Good boy, heel, hold it, hold it, good. Drop, we nailed him boys, woo -hoo! Smash that thumbs up button, come on now. We got another one out there that's dead. Fred, yes! I'm glad I pulled the trigger and did this. Here we go, set. We jammed. Fred. There we go, another one down. He fell real close. As you can see, I got the decoys really close. Good, drop. We go. <laughs> I am literally just sitting next to this, this cattle scratch right here. It's a back scratch deal. Uh, sitting in the shadow. Me and the guy, yeah. But please guys, smash the thumbs up for old Frederick. Come on now, let's get this video over 3,000 likes. You guys have been helping so much lately and I appreciate it so much. Uh, hope you guys are enjoying the hunting videos. The North Dakota Honker videos will be hitting the ground here real soon for y'all. Good boy! I couldn't even get the GoPro on, hold, hold on. Uh, we got a red bird. I think I got it on shot cam. I can't even load. Sit. 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 I can't load fast enough, guys. Good dog. Oh, we'll wait. Oh. <laughs> I got one. He's going down out back. Fred, sit. Heel, right here. Good. Coming back on the left. Fred. Good dog. Good boy. Good boy. Heel. Hold it. 
drop. There we go. <laughs> this is so cool. I can't even reload fast enough. I've been messing with the GoPro, trying to get my wind sock on it a little better. Again, sorry for the audio, guys. I'm gonna show you what all we got going on real quick. We got a dead spot. Stay, set. This is where we're setting me and old Frederick in the shadow here on the, on the uh, cattle back scratch. All we have is full bodies out here and a lot of them are already blowing over. We have a crazy, crazy south wind today. And uh, boy howdy, I'm glad that I called the farmer and just asked to do this. I'm like, would you mind, you know, the, the morning was kind of slow. He said, Bob, get out there and have fun. It's always worth asking, guys. On the left, sit. Red. Three birds, baby. first one he looked pretty special not gonna lie oh my goodness look at all the pigeons coming drop there we go look at all these pigeons Set. Fred. Bird. Good, here. Here. Fred. No bands yet, baby. We are sitting here piling these birds up. <laughs> he did. Yeah, gum, I'm gonna run out of shells, boys. Here, let's go. Good boy. Heel. Fred is doing amazing. Drop. There we go. Holy cow. Yes, the camera's going. This is crazy. This is crazy. You guys have to like this. Come on, y'all. Let's get as many likes as we can. Please help your boy out. Here comes some more. We got some birds out there we haven't even picked up yet. Good, set. Oh my goodness, good dog. I am so proud of Fred. He has not had any pigeon practice or anything and he is out here doing it like a pro. Hasn't broke one time, not even once. You're doing good guy, good job. All right, we got some more pigeons hitting the field. How many can we shoot? <laughs> Fred. I know we got one. I can see one. There's at least one or two birds we have not picked up. Holy cow, this is awesome. Dead bird. Dead bird. Dead bird. Dead bird. Good, here, three birds to pick up. Hold it, this is the special one. This is the special one. Look at this guy. Look at him. He's got some white on his head, white wings, good looking bird. <laughs> we got two more out there. Sit, heel, heel, Fred. He is doing so good. So good. Good boy, here. Good guy, that's my guy. Heel, hold it. Hold. Drop. There we go. One more that I know. Fred. Yes! 
Dead bird. Good dog. Come on now. Come on now. Heel. Sit. Drop. <laughs> yeah. Well, we better do some counting, I guess. It's slowing down a little bit. I've been sitting here for about 15 minutes. That's about it. So 15 minutes. We have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Twelve birds in 15 minutes. <laughs> that is awesome. I am pumped up, Frederico. This is the best uh, shooting practice you could get right before North Dakota. Here we go, on the left, on the left. This wind. Fred, that was a long shooter there. Fred's on the move. Good. Good boy. Heel. Oh no! That was really bad, Bob. That was horrible. Absolutely horrible. Fred! Cut the last one. I had to redeem myself. <laughs> Good boy. That was a long shot there, bud. That was a long shot. There went two. Oh. <laughs> uh, about 20, 25 yards behind us, there's a really big pond. And I just, I didn't even have the camera on. I popped a high one. He sailed over into the pond. Old Fred got to get wet and got a wet pigeon. <laughs> that a dog. I bet that cooled him off. That feel good, buddy? Two on the left, Freddy. Fred. That dog is doing amazing. My shooting ain't too bad. I've had two bad spells. Good here. Good here. Let's go. I've had two bad spells, but seems like it's getting a hair better. Drop. Good boy. There we go. We are making an absolute pile. Here we go, on the left. One. Two, Fred. <laughs> Two in the bag. <laughs> Tell me this isn't awesome. Tell me this isn't awesome. Three more coming. Good, Fred. Here, here, here. Fetch it up. Right here, over the top. Got one out of it. Got one out of them. Got it, Fred, here. Good boy, here. Drop. We got a long retrieve I'm gonna send Fred on. Fred, heel, heel. Here, here, here. Heel, heel, set. Fred. Lift your head up, buddy. Good boy, there we go. Chased him down for old dad. Good, come on, let's go. That's my dog. This is where we're sitting, like I said, in the shadow, me and the dog. Not sure how many birds we're at right now. 
I'd say we are at or approaching 20. Been here for maybe 30 minutes, maybe not. There we go. <laughs> that was a long shooter there, boys. There's an electric fence behind me about 20, uh, 10 yards. That bird hit the electric fence when it was going down. What are the odds of that? Come on, guy. That's my guy. He's thirsty. He's ready for a drink. Up top. Drop it. I cannot believe this hunt. This is crazy. Absolutely crazy. Good boy. This barrel is screaming hot. Red. Got two out of it. Fred's going on the long one. Oh, he's off to the races. There we go. Fred here. Let's go. That bird got away. We just got another one. Fred, dead bird. Good boy. This is hot and heavy, y'all. Hot and heavy action, <laughs> oh my goodness. It's just not stopping. It's just cranking here. Unbelievable. Guys, if you're new to the channel, get out there and do some dove hunting. It's the easiest way to get into wing shooting if you're new to duck hunting, goose hunting. Get out there, come September, do some dove hunting. All you need to go buy is one or two mojos and you'll be good to go. It's cheap. It's easy and it's shotgun friendly, even if you don't know a bunch. Get out there, get you some practice in. Uh, give it a try, y'all. Honestly, you're gonna love it. It's a good time. Look at all the blood on Fred's face. We look like we've been in battle, dude. Oh my goodness. I'm gonna have to get him a drink. We got two more birds right here. Can we get them both down? Oh. Oh, Bobby guy. Here you go. Drink. Drink here. Here. There you go. Is that good? Here. He don't know how to drink out of a bottle. He's just tired. All right, come on. Let's go. Come on. Luckily, there is a pond right here. We're going to let Fred get in. He's hot. He needs a drink. Look, he knows. Go. There we go. Oh, that feel good, buddy. Look, he's getting him a big drink. That's what's nice about hunting on this farmer. Oh yeah, Bob, use the pond. Do whatever you want. <laughs> Uh-oh. Come on, Fred, here, hurry. We got birds coming, Hill. Good boy. Lay down. Good. Pick it up, fetch it up. Here. Ah, oh, we got a white one. We got a white one! Yes! There's our white bird! Good job, Fred! Heel! Drop! Look at that! Yeah! I couldn't believe I hit that bird. He was going away. No bands, look at him. Wow. He's pretty. Fred Hill. Fred. Fetch it up. Good, here. Drop. Fred. We are crushing the pitch today, boys. This is awesome. There we go. 
Yeah! Friend! Two down, baby. I barely got that first one. Yes! Good dog. Come on. Oh, we got birds. Heel. Lay down. Lay down. Lay down. Good boy. Lay down. That is an old bird right there. Very old bird. Awesome hunt. Gonna make a few excuses here. Man, the wind. If I take too long to shoot, they hit the wind and they're really hard to hit. I've almost burned up three boxes and it's only been right at probably 30, 40 minutes. Uh, three boxes, almost three boxes. I'm gonna go real light on the last ones here. I only brought three boxes. I got more in the truck, but holy cow. This has been gnarly. Dude, look like you put in some work cause you did boy. That's a good dog absolutely amazing fred has done absolutely awesome so proud of him you deserve to go to north dakota dude yeah you do yeah you do such a good dog man oh darn it i'm out of shells and we got more pigeons come on we'll go get another box see right just like that i waited too long caught the wind completely missed him there's a man there's a lot of pigeons coming still way more than i originally anticipated we gotta hurry here comes a red one come on we got him fred That's the red one I was talking about. <laughs> They're so close. I think that's the deal. I have the decoy so incredibly close that they're just close. When they're that close, oh, ha, ha! no. That's a homer. That's a homer. Look at that. Triple band. We got a band! Oh my goodness, look at that. We got a triple band. Oh my goodness. Drop. Holy cow. First band of the year. Wow. Wow, look at this. This says Jose Loft. It might have a, yeah, it has a number on it, a phone number. It has a phone number on it. We're gonna have to call it. Holy cow. Wow, I have never shot a red, red and white banded homer. That's unreal. Wow, I did not expect that, Fred. Good job. Sit. Fred. Good, here. Oh my goodness. Good job, sit. That is crazy. Wow. Wow. Unreal hunt today, guys. Unreal hunt. Wow. I am so blown away. I'm speechless. Still got birds to shoot, though. Fred. Good dog. Has not broke one time. Come on, guys. Smash the thumbs up button for this whole video and Fred. This is awesome, man. This is awesome. He needs his neck run. Wow. 
Holy cow. Unbelievable. Okay, hope you guys can see and hear me. Here is our banded Homer. You can get a really good look at him now. Check out the head on a Homer. Got that really flat nose. See how flat it is with the forehead? Right here, you should be able to put a ruler on there and that be straight. That's how you know you got a Homer. Uh, also, Homers, really big wings. They, they fly really strong. Got a really nice sharp breastbone awesome looking bird he's got three bands on him this one's a clip band that i actually blew off i hit it and about knocked it complete off it's the same band as this green one and this green one says jose loft with his phone number and then underneath that is the actual band number 76 au 2020 air capital so what that tells me that this bird was banded last year 2020 in Wichita Kansas which is about 35 40 minutes away from me so this bird ended up over here lost out of its original owners loft let's uh, give this guy a call tell him we got his bird and hopefully he is not super pissed at me or something there's no way he can be mad at me the bird would never come back and I guarantee he's gonna state that. Hopefully, he's a nice guy. Let's see. <laughs> oh. Hello? Hi, is this Jose? Yeah. How are you doing? This is Bobby Guy. Yeah. Um, I shot one of your pigeons and I am in, uh -huh. I am in as well. Yeah. I'll be darn. It was, um, I thought it was going to be an AU band from Wichita. Um, no, I was hunting over, you know where One Oak is? No. Where, where's your loft at? I'm not here in the middle of town. Oh, you're in the middle of town. Yeah. Oh, see, I was, I was hunting, uh, pigeons in the country. Oh, yeah. Has have you have you lost one lately? A uh, number seventy six, a red bird. Uh, I think so. Yeah. Yeah. Huh? Do you, if you want your yeah. bands back or your bird, I I have it, but he's obviously not alive. Darn it. Okay. I'm sorry about that. I just figured I would let you know. Uh, do you want me to bring you the bird or anything? No. Okay. No, that's fine. Okay. Yeah. I just like, okay. I, I, I really like how you put your uh, phone number on there. That's the first one that I came across that has an easy phone number to get a hold of the owner. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I, I do a lot of feral pigeon hunting and sometimes this happens. Okay. Yep. Well, thank you, man. I appreciate it. All right. Thank you. Have a good day, Jose. Thank you, too. Bye. Bye. There you go. He lives in my hometown, and he's AU registered loft in the middle of town. I never even knew that there was a legit loft in the middle of town. He said that, you heard him, he said number 76 has been lost, and he don't even want it back. There you go. That was cool. <laughs> Again, guys, please, let's get this video to 3K, 5K, 10K, something K. Well, hi. Look how good he is. He's just been sitting there waiting for me to get out of the truck. I can tell you what today did for old Freddy. It got his confidence back. Look at him. He's ripping and roaring. Oh, when that dog can make his owner happy, 
He's happy. Hi, buddy. You got blood all over. You look like you've been a working dog. We better get you in and get you a bath, man. I am not having you stink in the back of in the back seat of my truck because that's where he's going to be for the next week while we're in North Dakota. Guys, I hope you guys are staying tuned for the honker hunts that come in North Dakota. Um, guys, get out there. Give it a try. Don't doubt yourself. Do not doubt yourself. You've seen today, this morning I had my two buddies. Uh, luckily, I found a pigeon feed for us tomorrow. I'm going to try to redeem myself for them. This morning, it was horrible. They shot three birds while I went and found the pigeon feed. Turns out, where we hunted this morning is actually the afternoon hunt. We should have, I should have known. So, um, I'm, I'm glad I just had the confidence to, uh, to just send it today. I found it. I'm like, yeah, we're a little late. I'm just going to try it. And it, 57 birds, I mean, pretty much 60 birds by myself in about an hour and a half of sh actual shooting and a band. I don't know if I've had, if I've ever had such a rewarding hunt. Plus, we got Frederick out on there and he absolutely crushed it. He picked up every single bird. I'm done blabbing. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, tell your buddies to come check out the channel. Tell your dad. Share this video. And uh, go out there. Get outside. Take a buddy hunting. But before we leave here, guys, my podcast is on Patreon. We're giving away three hunts right now here at my lodge at Sand Hill Flyways. A goose hunt for January, a snow goose hunt for February, and a turkey hunt coming this coming spring. So, all these hunts we're giving away is for two guys. Whoever wins it and a buddy. You can bring your wife, a buddy, your brother, your dad, your mom, whatever. But the podcast subscribers, my Patreons, are the only ones eligible to win these hunts. The podcast is always linked down in the description below, right at the top. Go check it out. You'll like it. I have not had one negative comment about it yet. Do it. You'll like it. You'll love it. But until next time.